Hi. Am I visible? Hi, you are visible. You are visible okay. to me. So, how are you? Yeah, I'm doing great. Uh, let me introduce myself. I'm Sumalata. I live in the South Hyderabad. I'm from Telangana State. And uh, I completed my graduation, MCOM. And uh, I'm a married woman. And I have a 10 years daughter. Earlier, I used to work as a teacher. So I left the job in 2019 at the time of COVID. Uh, after that, I'm not doing anything. So this is my introduction. Wow, that's great, that's great. So I just want to, what would you teach like when you were a teacher? What was your major subject? Uh, I was a primary teacher as a mother teacher. Okay, okay. So how's, the, how's, how's are the things going on these days? Like as your housewife, so you just have a lot of responsibility of your house. Yes, as a yes. Kid and everything. yes, yes. When I used to work, no, that time my daughter is very small. So uh, she's in the study, that time she studies in LKG like that. Um, after that, what happened? I started that I'm unable to manage to both the things because she's from different school and, and I'm from, I'm working in a different school. So that's why I thought that uh, to leave the job, first of all, I, I should give more importance to my daughter. So now it's okay. I'm managing. So she she needs more care now. That's why. Exactly. Daily, yeah. after, As in uh, mother, I think these days, uh, I just want to tell to all, we, we need to make our child. I, I know, but what I learned for myself, I just think if my mother had in my earlier, would make me responsible for everything, only very small things. Because what happens as a mother's, Every mother thinks that to help her children, right? But yes, I think yes. as, instead of helping, if they just try to make them responsible for everything on, on every small things, so she won't be yes. yeah, she won't be able to depend on others in like in their future. Yes, yes. So at that time I feel very bad that I'm missing some important time. I'm missing some quality time with her. So uh, first I should give preference to her. And after that, once she gets settled down, I'll go again. Once she grown up to from like the 15 years like that, I'll, again I'll do. Till then, I want to look from work from home like that. So that, for this, um, for that, uh, I'm working on my English. So how do you work on English? Like when did this um, things came in your mind that you need to learn English? And yeah. what was this? Since from childhood, I have a passion to learn English. So when I was in a 10th class, uh, that time we used to have a Rapidex English course book. So I brought that and um, I used to, daily I used to read one page like that. Uh, after that, I don't have any environment to speak with someone because all of my friends are, they speak Marathi and Hindi like that. So very few friends are there who speak. And for them, that time also they'll, when they'll start telling that we'll speak, but again, it'll not continue. So... Uh, after that, uh, I, I, when I completed my post graduation, I, I tried for a job. Uh, I, I have done job in a U, my what do you say, BPO, BPO call centers, and uh, in a small, uh, you can say in a small company, firms like that, as a uh, what do you say, executive, customer care executive. That so I find I feel that the, that job is very helpful for me to communicate. Okay, so again, that uh, after that I had uh, got married and I left the job. So now I feel that it's a free time to learn and I, I should uh, again come back to on my passion. I, I want to continue this. So what do you think now? Do you want to continue with your job now? Or you just want to be this house for me? No, no. First I want to, I want to keep a small goal. First, uh, I I will be very much, uh, I, I want to learn English very fluently. Again, I'll start. Because every time if you go to some interviews, you know, they'll tell that your good is your English is good, but you need some more confidence like that. I don't know why if a person comes to me in, in like a uh, info, I'm okay. But if a com person come to me on my, like face to face, that time I'll get fumble. And uh, uh, what happened, I used to forget some words like that. So how I'm practicing my English means uh, daily I watch some videos, podcasts like that. Uh, and, uh, from what this uh, February onwards, I'm daily I'm working. Uh, consistently I'm working on this. 
I used to watch some videos, and after that, I'll do some what do you say mirror talking, and I'll talk to myself, and I'll do I'll use talk no app. There I used to talk with a few persons daily for thirty minutes like that. So the, this is how I'm practicing. So you have made your own schedule or your to-do list to work in English language, right? Yes, yes. Exactly. Yeah, what I did was following the same. When I was learning this language, I have just made my own to-do list. Like today, I just have to complete all these kinds of things to improve my English language. And mm -hmm. the way you talk about, like uh, you was working in a DPO about uh, like a uh, call center. So I was thinking if there could be like something in my surrounding, I would definitely work on this. I was searching so that I could improve my English language. But you got the chance. You're gonna be first. You got the chance to work there. So mm -hmm. I'm here. For, yeah. So what's going on like these days? Like uh, you are doing practice on speaking. So how long have you been like I can say? How long have you been working on in, in audio English language? Yeah. Uh, you see, after uh, I'll get free from eleven o'clock like that. After completion of my house chores like that, then I'll start calling on this. Uh, I use for thirty five minutes like that. After that, uh, this this is a speaking practice. After that, again I'll take a some break and uh, I'll read some books. Any any book, any English book like that. And then I'll give some time to what I um, listening to the podcast like that. So whenever uh, I come to across with a new word. You see, I'll I'll get it. I don't need. I get don't need that word, and I'll make few sentences on that. Like this, I'll work. I'll make some few sentences and work on. I'll work on that word. Um, that's amazing because you know I can see the way you have followed. I have followed the same thing. I would whenever I would get like whenever I would watch the videos and I would get the unfamiliar vocabulary and then I would make the sentence of it. And I think this is the best way to work on the vocabulary. Because if I yes, if yes. you don't make the like if you learn the words and if you don't make the sentences of it, so we may forget it after a couple of yes, days. Yes, yes, we forget it. That. Yeah. So most of I watch the videos of Shanta Madam only. So I I have seen you when you while you are talking with her. I seen I have seen that video. So there I got some valiantly or like that that word. I came to cross to that the new word, like that. So some idioms also she use. So I'll call. I'll daily I use that word. So. Wow. So you really inspired me a lot. Uh, I think uh, I have seen your second videos and one more video with the Surabhi ma'am also. So. Yeah. Actually, that was my first video. I have never made the video with anyone. Actually, I can say two years back I had made one videos, but now that way when I started my own YouTube channel. So I started my the uh, my own videos about uh, like uh, how to work on our habits and our goal and everything. But I thought mm -hmm. I thought let me make videos on English language as well because people really need it. And that's mm -hmm. why my videos was first one was with Santa Ma'am and second one was Survey. Santa Ma'am's video is the first one. Yeah, that was my first one. Okay, okay. Mm hmm. So, um, which point you attracted me a lot means um, that every day you you says you says to grab you do gratitude, isn't it? You said there's some like that. That's at that inspired me a lot. Even I also do like that. So that is the only thing where we can motivate ourselves, isn't right. it? Yeah. Right. So what do you do like for gratitude? I mean, what do you say to yourself? Uh, I usually say that I'm the best. I can do anything, and uh, uh, I'm the winner. God is always with me. Today is wow. my day. Wow, like that. that's um, yeah. Because you know what happens. I just believe whatever we call about ourselves. Now we start feeling the same things, and when yes, we yes. feel, we start taking action in the same way. It's very important to say positive things to to ourselves. Yes. Yeah. So Actually, how you started? Yeah. Yeah, I would like to ask you one thing. How you started your journey? Uh, Miss, so who inspired you to start YouTube channel? I mean, to say you to learn English like that. No one inspired me. Actually, I can say to be honestly, I just think that I need to do something or else in my life. 
and mm -hmm. uh, for starting youtube channel i was just thinking to work with uh, like people always i was thinking i should do something so that i could work with the people i would connect with the people and uh, the, i started my youtube channel in december like i can say 20 december yeah and mm -hmm. right now, even now i'm not that much confident in front of the main camera i'm not that okay. much because when i started making the videos i would feel so uncomfortable but i was thinking mm -hmm. i would myself that if i don't now then when because if i, I have yes. to come on and get out of this like uncomfortable zone i just have to be com like comfortable with the camera so i just kept on making the videos even sometimes now i feel come like i'm comfortable but i'm just keep going and uh, i can say uh, you are the motivation so no one literally motivated me my passion it was my passion that i just want to work with the people and uh, i just have only one alternative to work with the people and that is i can say youtube channel and that's why i started even my in my family only my younger sister know that i am running a youtube channel no one knows it yes yes so see what happened uh, when when i had a phone uh, i mean to say two years back i think i started running youtube channel uh, it is on the name of my husband only so that time i used to upload cooking videos like that even though i have a passion for learning but uh, a little bit um, what do you say shy i'm a most of i'm a shy person i'll not uh, open to everyone like that so you know what happened if i talk to uh, if i face uh, like camera and uh, people will see what they laugh like that so um, i i i upload only three videos like that on that channel and the rest of the videos are about the food food blogs like that only so where can i i'm not visible on that video like that so again uh, when i so many these days i, I used to watch so many conversation videos so i left this type of the things long back only why don't i start once again so this um, thought again <laughs> trigger me and so i'm watching now but i didn't upload any video from that time but now you can continue with it because yes, i think yes. when you make videos so you'll be able to help to others youtubers and you'll be able to work on your communication skill as well yes like, yes i feel that i'm a basic learner it's not that yes. i'm it's not that everyone of us learners when we keep on doing over the over and over again so i can say we can be no i i'm not saying we can be master but we can improve a lot by doing that things over and over again yes yes even though i'm from english medium from the beginning but uh, i never spoke to anyone it is medium it doesn't matter i am from hindi medium i have just uh, studied in english medium for years 2 3 4 5 and after okay. five to graduation i have done from hindi medium but what i think is that even a english medium i have seen lots of students they are not able to speak in english just because yes, they yes. teach english in this like a subject not like a language and this is the main yes. reason they speak in english yes Yeah. So uh, I thought that the way, the way, only way for us to learn is speak. Unless and until we open and we we open our mouth, we know we doesn't learn this language like that. So I started again, and daily I used to speak with my daughter. So now uh, I am observing myself only. I am getting late daily. I am uh, what do you say? Um, from the beginning, I used to talk very less. So I daily I am improving myself. and i used to record my videos also when i see the first video no and and i'll see the recent videos my english is a little bit improved so this is the way i'm learning that's mind blowing i can say recording when you record yourself na so we are able to find our mistake and it is yeah. the best way for ourselves yes yes one more thing is we will what do you say come out of the fear also facing the camera exactly yes Okay, dear. I think let's call it a day. It's been around two or three minutes. So I really like the way you talk, the way you explain everything. I really like it. Thank you so much for having me. Yeah, me too. Same here. Thank you very much. Thank All you. Right.